What's going on you guys? IFBB Pro, David Short here. I'm at my local grocery store today and I'm gonna show you guys how to get big on a budget. So I'm gonna show you guys what my typical grocery haul looks like and we're gonna try and keep it under hundred bucks today. So follow me through the store and I'll show you guys what we get at the end. So even though we're going for like a bodybuilder style diet, uh, especially if you're bulking, fruit is a really good and easy way to get some calories in. Plus you always wanna have some kind of micronutrients that you can get through fruit. Um, one of my favorites, as well as the cheapest alternatives that you can have for fruit are gonna be some bananas. So you can see here they're 50 cents per pound. Um, and I pretty much wanna grab like four here. These are great pre and post workouts, um, have a lot of good uh, micronutrients in them as well as they're a really good, easy digesting carb source. Okay, so for a protein source, a little bit cheaper than chicken is going to be a tilapia filet. Two pounds here is right under 10 bucks, it is 9.86. So this should last us for two pounds, even if you do eight ounces twice a day, this should last, oh man, putting on the spot math. It's two pounds, should last about four days. All right, so next thing that we got here is gonna be some red meat. Uh, probably the best bang for your buck is going to be a ground beef. We got 96.4, 93.7 ground beef here. I typically do the 96.4, but if you are balling on a budget and you want some extra fats in your diet, the 93.7 beef will be a great alternative for you. This will make about two or three meals, depending on what your serving sizes are, and it's only 550 per tub. Okay, so we've done some protein sources and now we're gonna go into some carbs. So um, every morning for the past 10 years of this like fitness journey I've been on, my, my meal one, my breakfast, has always contained oats. So um, honestly, I just grabbed the cheapest ones I can find. These are AGBs, which is like this grocery store. Um, they're just like the generic name brand um, of oats. So this is... Serving's half a cup, there's 13 servings here, so it's about seven cups um, for only 2.48. So this will last two, three weeks. Okay, so next, uh, if you guys have seen my pre-workout video, uh, I do Rice Krispie cereal pretty often if I you know, don't do cream of rice or rice cakes. So uh, for this crispy rice cereal, again, the name brand versus the, the actual name brand. Um, the generic brand is only 248, and again, this lasts over a week easily. Okay, so typically I always use rice for a lot of my meals as well. Uh, I have plenty of rice at the house already, so I'm gonna go with sweet potatoes this week. So I honestly just get frozen ones, they're a little bit cheaper and easier, so they are gonna be a little bit more expensive per bag. But in addition with my rice, um, I usually kind of do half a bag per serving. I use these uh, and that's 368. So that's another kind of two meals that you can knock out there. These would, this would pair really well with your beef meals. So uh, if you have one beef meal per day, um, you can hit you know pretty much two beef meals with each of these. Okay, so again, like I said, with my meal one, I always have oats. I al also always have eggs. So. I'm gonna get a dozen eggs here. I think it's 269 for a dozen whole eggs. I usually have three eggs, so again, this will last me about four days. At only 269. Okay, and finally, rounding out our fat sources, we have natural creamy peanut butter. Uh, this will last weeks or even a month. Um, $2.34, can't beat that. All right, and then final thing that we're gonna add, just because I'm pretty sure we got extra money left over. Um, if you are struggling to get your food down, you're not a huge eater, appetite isn't really there, or if you just hate the way that clean food tastes, um, this G Hughes sugar-free, uh, sugar yeah, sugar-free barbecue sauce is a game changer for one serving, which is 30 grams, it's only two carbs. If you use 30 grams, that's ridiculous. Like you'll probably use half a serving, um, which will be one gram of carb. So definitely prep friendly, definitely off season friendly and only four bucks this will last you know a good month or so too so i'm gonna add that in the cart and i think that should be it All right, so just checked out, if you saw the total on the screen, I think it was 36 something, 35, let's say 35 bucks. So 
pretty much what we got was enough for pretty much about four days worth of meals. So if you double that, that's pretty much eight days worth of meals for about 70 bucks. So definitely under your $100 budget if you are trying to eat clean, eat good foods on a budget. Definitely highly recommend that. Um, hopefully that helps you guys out. So um, if you guys have any questions as it pertains to diet, uh, what foods to eat, when to eat it, drop a comment down below, shoot me a message. Uh, appreciate you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.